subtle or a bold look, Dr. Hauschka Makeup offers you the ideal finish for any situation. Their formulation is based on natural mineral pigments, which visually blend in with your own hair and skin tone. As such, even bold tones will appear natural and will never look artificial. Brows are so important to complete your look, and with a few steps I'll show you how to get them. First of all, let me tell you what I used on your face. I took care of your complexion by using a suitable skincare for you. I also used some lip gloss and compact powder to mattify your face. So let's just start by evaluating the length of your brows. If you take a brush and you add it to the side of your nose and connect it to your tear dog right here, you know where your eyebrows will start. In order to find out where it should stop, you just draw an imaginable line with that brush from the side of your nose to the corners of your eye you know where it should stop. And the highest part of your brow is the arch. It's the last third which should drop and two thirds go up previously. So two thirds go up and one third goes down. So without any further ado, let's start the application. You take a clean mascara wand. You start by brushing your eyebrows down. Now if you use a slanted brush, now our eye and brow palette, you can use a mixture of shades which you prefer. I love the third shade. Add it to the tip of the brush. You start on the highest point, but not right in the front, as you don't want the majority of color to stick right in the front, and you work your way inwards. Draw an imaginable high line, two parts going up, like mentioned before, and the third part falling. Having done this, you use a disposable mascara wand again and brush your brows up. Now you can use the slanted brush again to fill in any possible gaps that you might have created. To finish off your signature brow, simply use a small amount of our brown dish gel. The formulation of nourishing botanical ingredients such as neem and eyebright nourishes lashes and eyebrows. Last in line, use the lightest shade of our eye and brow palette as a highlighter right under your eyebrows. So Angelica, how do you usually like your eyebrows? I like them strong and defined. Oh, that's great. So I cannot wait for you to take a look in the mirror. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you.